Speaker, and back to the Minister of Health and Long-Term Care. Congratulations on your new post. For years, long-term care capacity issues have been one of my constituents' biggest concerns. That's because Halliburton Kawartha Lakes Brock has the highest ratio of need to available beds in Ontario. There are currently 2,169 people on the wait list for long-term care beds in my riding, and on any given day, 30 to 40 percent of local hospital beds are occupied by people who should be receiving care in long-term care homes. This government is failing our seniors, Mr. Speaker. It's unacceptable that our mothers, our fathers, our grandparents waiting years to get the care they so desperately need. So my question to the minister is, how does she explain this government's failure on this file question. to the more than 2,000 people waiting for long-term care beds in my riding? Yeah. Yeah. Minister. Well, thank you very much, uh, Mr. Speaker. And of course, uh, we are addressing the capacity challenges uh, that the member opposite is referencing. And we are aware of different demographics in different communities. And certainly, this is why this call for applications is uh, being looked at so closely to make sure that we match um, the new beds with uh, the need in the community. As she referenced uh, some of the issues around hospital overcrowding, as well. So I do want to remind her that we have created 503 transitional care spaces outside of, outside of hospital for up to 1,700 patients who don't require care in a hospital. So we're trying to address each piece of this uh, issue of capacity, and yes, I believe that we're going in exactly the right direction. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.